I saw the right stuff. I don't know. I that like uh, some guy's name is Justin, uh, not Khalil. It's like you know, it doesn't look like he's from Africa or Haiti or some shit. Even if his hair or I, I don't know. I'm like, it's like a coincidence that somebody has so many different problems at once, producing like features of shit, right? That's like brittle hair or frizzy hair is like a symptom of like some type of malfunctioning organ or some crap, right? Like, wow, my liver is fucked up. And that means my skin can easily become fucked up. Like, I can have bad skin or acne or blemishes or my skin can turn darker than usual. It can also affect like the protein makeup in my hair and whatnot. Meaning like, if my hair is usually curly and whatnot, like how normal biracial people's hair are if they're like half black or half something, and I don't know. You know, it's to say, like, if I can restore my hair to its natural state, it doesn't look like anybody's over there in Africa. I don't know. Like, hey, what if Justin was, like, an actual biracial kid, and then, like, some guy can easily have, like, actual biracial features in him, right? Which his name is not Khalil or Cow. It's like Cow is, like, an, a forged identity over there in Africa. So, you know, I, I wanted to make talk about something. I was gonna do this earlier, but since yeah, I still have time in my hand and I, you know, I just wanna joke about being attacked by the SpongeBob's. Like attack of the SpongeBob's. Like when are they gonna burn me alive? What if they were plotting to burn somebody alive since 2003 and still haven't done it yet? And yet now they're gonna finally do it, and still don't get around to doing it, right? So yeah. Hmm. I don't know. I, I, I say like they were like serious. Like, like, I, like I'm gonna say SpongeBob's a lot of different people I want. That's what they're doing it now. You know, it's like a, a village mob of fraternity people in there, right? Like the fraternity village. The gay Illuminati. The, the gay Minati. It's like it's a gay organization. It's gonna burn you alive. We're not supporting their weird crap you don't give a fuck about, or for not wanting to be a part of it, or for not knowing, or for not giving a shit about shit pain, which you would suck up. They would invent pain, or foot pain upon you, or if you don't want them to like, fuck up your identity or some shit that is completely false, like Khalil, like that's not my name. <laughs> it never was my name. It make it like you are born in Africa, as if you're a pure but African, but even your DNA is like proof of learning that you're not even African. Like, like you're like half something else. That doesn't tell them anywhere near Africa. It's, it's proof alone that you're not from Africa. Like, and they're gonna, like, like try to torture your ass alive. Like, burn him! You know, I didn't fucking do it. I like, have been fighting things like this for the longest, right? Or, like, say if somebody wanted to kill me since I was, like, a nine year old little kid or some crap, but yet they hired doctors to do it. Like, a dude named Ian. I like pay him under the table with like utilize e and, uh, uh, mercury treatment or some crap. And then, like, I don't know how some guy survives things, but somehow he survives shit. Uh, I, from that day on, I don't like trying to fuck up your foods. Right? I don't know. I, I call these other health problems. I, I have no idea, man. Alright, this organization is like. Like a lot of people are part of it because I, I believe it has a lot of perks and or benefits, right? I, I, it's like getting special deals and or discounts with people that you're in the gay fraternity too. I could work out a special deal, my brother. How, how about this gay shit here? I'm closing the window. I'm not gay. I'm not closing my window to show my ass. When it closes, it's to, uh, like, you know, to, to deafen the sound of it. Shit, man. But I'm not gay at all. I don't know what the fuck it's just I should have sat down. It's not get up at all. Because, like, you know, it's sound language which crap is we at. I don't want nobody thinking I'm, like, performing some type of weird sound language. Because, like, I don't know. Like, I gotta get the fuck out of this day, man. Like, this is just too fucking stupid and retarded. Like, ah. Gay people have language too. I didn't know I'm not gay. What the fuck? I'm not part of gay shit. I'm gay fraternity, sorority, or some crap. Give a shit less.
But all I know is, like, I'm sure I'm not from Africa. Can't make like some guys from Africa. Can't make like some dude who has like African parents and all, because like, you know, like your DNA doesn't match ours in some place called Africa. Right? You're not like some golden child so they're trying to make like some new days. <laughs> like your name is not Khalil, it is Justin. Right? Like you was changed, like when you were a baby, there you go. Like, you know, a lot of people change their names or have their names changed. You know, it's like, like how, like, Marilyn Monroe was born as Norma Jean or some crap. And then, like, her name been changed to Marilyn Monroe. Like, like how some guy could have been, like, Justin whatever, you know? Like, Justin Lopez. And then suddenly his name became, like, like freaking Brandon Mackey. It's like, you know, it's like, it's not, it's not impossible to do a shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't know. Some guy who's like half Latino and half black, not not being from Africa, because like he, he does his, his his like racial makeup is not concentrated fully in Africa, but but it's like multiracial and all, right? I don't know. And that's to say like if he's born like in the Midwest, like like near like whatever and all, like somewhere in Illinois or freaking like like Detroit. Or, or like, say, like, his, his uh, biological mother is, like, a nomad. Like, she likes traveling all the time, because that's what she did. Like, she doesn't like being in one spot all the freaking time. She, like, she has, like, an infant with her. Like, infant is traveling with her as well, you know, right? If she wants to give it up for adoption, then uh, she gives it up for fucking adoption. All right, Illinois, Detroit, freaking Ohio's, like, freaking Jersey's and Pennsylvania's and... Like, all right, all right, maybe some chick is like like a gypsy or some crap. Why is my video frame rate slowing down? I hate when it does that because it looks like my video is unauthentic right now, like as if I'm faking this video and I'm not. This is me filming it. You know, see, like my hands look like they're in like some type of slow motion thing. Like like your frame rate just got slow. Like no. I am not faking this video. This is a guy named Brandon Mackey recording it. Speaking of attack of the SpongeBob's, SpongeBob is many different peoples. Like people who like like shitting in your folds. To make like they did nothing wrong. To make like you're the wrong guy. When it's actually them. Cause like it's like a fatality. Like the uh. The flaming Dutchman, the Scottish Dutchman, I don't know. I don't know. I'm like, if people want to kill me, like, I say like people actually don't want to kill me, like, because I'm like a, a highly disliked person since since he was born and all. Like, you know, you're gonna have somebody trying to toss a baby named Justin off a boat to get rid of it, because like, I, I don't, I don't know why, you know. To probably take it to identity, their identity later. Who knows? Or maybe Justin is missing in action. Hey, uh, there's a baby named Justin who's missing from like 1989. Like, ah, oh, shit, what a coinky dink. There's an anonymous wicked identity contrived around this time. Like, you know, Africa can make up any fucking thing, right? Like, shit. I bet I can make up a random name over there in Africa. Like, uh, what, what type of fucking crazy name I could probably come up with over there? Like, like, uh, hmm. A Tukafuk or some shit, you know? Like, I could probably come up with a name over there in Africa. Like, can I make up this name over there? That sounds ridiculous, right? Like, a Tukafuk or some shit. Like, yeah. Like, let me go to Nigeria some crap. Or have somebody in Nigeria forge this shit. Which obviously sounds like a crop of fucking shit, but it's possible because it's Africa. <laughs> yeah. Or, or somewhere in like like South Africa coming out this crap. You know, to make like a person who's not even like African or purely African who's like from there, you know. You know? Like, you know, you can be like a Native American or some shit, or a part Native American. I know Native Americans or Latino people who's here in Africa. 
I don't think that sounds like an African accent, and I don't even know any type of African language to mimic right now. That that's that's how non-African I am right at the moment. Like shit, man. Here we go with this shit again. Ah, man. I'm gonna try and deport people to places they're not from. That's like somebody being inconsistent. They make like you're from Mexico and then like Africa at the same time. I'm like that 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 there alone should like be proof that somebody's making up crap, right? You are from Africa. Hey, uh, this guy just accused me of being from Mexico. Somehow, I don't know why, but I'm like, you know, I obviously live in the United States, and, I, and the only south of the border I live from currently is Pittsburgh or, or Pennsylvania. So I'm like, hmm, yeah. How am I from Africa? They like it's Pittsburgh in Africa or, or freaking Chicago or some crap. You know, I don't know. It's Baltimore in Africa. This is the city I currently live in. Like I, I just. I somehow just like spontaneously came over here from like like a split second ago and, and living in the city my entire life having a history of living here like, like having a childhood here in the city taking pictures of organizations like Boy Scouts you know, of America since I was like in the third grade you know which is like a long long time ago it's like before some doctor like became like a, a dickwad or an asshole and then like a tax little kid for no apparent reason. I don't know. Hey, I get paid to beat up little boys. Like, oh, you're a dickwad. Man. You're... Yeah. Cause maybe like the whole accusing this kid from being... That's like somebody suddenly accusing you of being from India if you state you're part Native American Indian. Like, I'm quite Indian. Like, you're from India! Like, no, I, that, that means I, I'm Native American. It's like, not, na not I'm fully Native American, I'm part Native American. Like, like, my skin alone is like proof that I'm Native American. It's like, it's like, like, uh, racial protection or some shit. Of, of like, 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 uh, d distinguishing you against bullshit claims of being from Africa or some crap, because, like, people in Africa don't have this trait. Right? I don't know. This is stupid. And then it can make like somebody from Ethiopia or something, but you still don't look like people there. You know, like you don't have their features, their lips are different, even if they have like different types of hair. Like, you know, you're still standing apart. Like they're still not meat like the American Indian peoples that you're a part of here, that you have in your culture as well, like genealogy, because like you live in this part of the, the globe called America that has these people living here. Or have a history of these people living here who lived in this country first, right? Yeah, here we go. Logic. I don't know, man. Like just because like you have black people who came from Africa 300 years ago, or they like look as if they are from Africa, like, like in this fucking country, that doesn't that doesn't mean like I, that's your story or, or lineage or some crap. Like you could be completely different. You could be like half Hispanic or some shit, right? Like, wow, I'm half, uh, Mexican or something. Yeah, don't look it. And half blacks, and part Native Americans, and you have all these traits intertwined with one. And your hair is different than usual, but since you're sick with a disease that affects your liver, like, it makes it all frizzy and nappy looking. You know, maybe I should just, like, go to curly hair again. But then if I do curly hair, people make as if I'm gay. I, I, no, I'm not gay. My hair is naturally curly. I'm not. I'm not trying to do some S curl, Jerry curl shit. You know, my hair is curly. I'm not gay. I don't know. Besides, I don't like growing out hair because like, it's a lot to maintain. I usually cut it bald. I don't know. This is retarded, man. Like, nothing makes any sense. Uh, and, and in this country, like, like with this gay organization, I'm speaking of. Like, they're, like, everywhere. They can be, like, judges or fucking, like, agents or cops or people in INS. Or, or, or people who want to, like, like, like f fabricate crap against people. So they can get, like, their other friends or, if, like, associates are part of this crap. An edge. You know? Like, I need you to arrest this nigga so that I can steal his name and identity. Alright, and we put the same gas organization of fucking Freemasons or... Fag, fag Illuminati crap, like whatever fancy crap they want to hide behind, like some some weird, elegant title of fakeness. 